today's session, we're looking deeply in at what's introduced in section 6.4 of the book, a fundamental misconception that sweeps through pretty much all of economics, all of business studies about how the world works whenever anything is coming in that is about random chance, good fortune or bad fortune. And this is something that actually has very, very deep consequences for investors who are using a portfolio approach to investment, for business leaders who are taking decisions about what profit margin is necessary to lead to a certain level of business performance. This fundamental misconception leads to portfolios that fail, business strategies that take the company into the ground, and perhaps Worst of all, it leads to blame games, superficial fudges and fixes that are actually repairing something that is being caused by a fundamental misunderstanding of how the world works. This is a simulation of exactly this situation across 100 companies, each company starting off at a thousand euros bank balance and tossing that coin 365 times, which represents, let's say, one year of sales cycles, or this could represent 100 companies in a portfolio. <clears throat> the dotted line moving up, let me just, so the dotted line up there is the 5% growth rate that normal statistics says you should expect. And what you see is by the end, 365 times, 92% of the companies have already gone bankrupt. If I were to continue it down to a thousand, pretty much every single company will have gone bankrupt. In this case, the expectation value is this black dosh dat line over here. What this in essence is saying is that in this kind of situation, the normal statistics is fundamentally wrong. If you continue with this gamble for long enough, you will never get to that dotted 5% growth line. You will get closer and closer to this dash dot loss line, which is 5.1% loss per throw on average. What it means for investors, for example, if you're investing in a portfolio and the numbers look like this, in other words, there's a strong domination from good or bad fortune, you're going to end up losing money across your portfolio when you think you should gain money. Or put a different way, the risk in a portfolio is significantly higher than most people realize using normal statistics because their statistics predicts that dotted line up there, when in reality, it's this dash dot line here that dominates. If instead of having a portfolio, you structure as an ecosystem of companies, this is what you get. And the more the companies hang together as an ecosystem, the closer they get to the dash, the dotted average that you would expect from naive statistics. What's inside this particular simulation is that after every coin toss, the companies that got lucky and grew by 50% share 1% of their winnings with all of the companies in the ecosystem. So at about 50% win, 50% lose, that means that each company that wins 50% shares on average half a percent of their winning with the companies that didn't win that cycle. And you can see that just that level of collaboration of sharing winnings fundamentally changes the dynamics of an ecosystem of companies.